thought that you just wanted to be friends. I don't think we can ever be just friends. Their chemistry literally carries the whole film. It's so good. It's a romance, it's a love story, but it is also a coming of age story. Heartache is part of coming of age. It's mm -hmm. part of, you know, finding out who you are and exploring yourself and to me finding out also who who's good for you and who's not good for you. And, right. and that's a big part of after. I think that it's better if we keep our distance. <laughs> what do you guys think is going to be the most surprising scene for everyone to watch? There's a um, twist. That's probably going to be the most surprising scene for people who haven't read the books. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't want to say what it is. I know, I know. Don't yeah. want to spoil it. But I'd it's agree, a twist. I'd agree. Yeah. Something's going on, but it's not what you think. Surprising part. I love Josephine. So okay. I felt bad, like especially the scene that everyone's kind of anticipating, where it's like the big reveal. Yes. Like I felt so bad because I like she's like literally crying in front of me, and I'm like, mm, well, I'm supposed to act like I don't care, but like even yeah. care. I'm like, oh well, that's not my fault. And then when it cut, I was like, are you okay? Can I have a hug, please? Because <laughs> I'm so sorry. I did not mean to make you cry. Nothing could ever change the way that I feel about you. Casting the leads, Josephine and Hero, and and that chemistry that they have. It's so undeniable. Yeah, we really got really lucky with that because they didn't have chemistry reads together. They both had them with other people. What are you dreaming about? But with Hero, Jenny Gage and I, it was pretty much like immediate thing. When she saw him, she knew. When I saw him, I knew. With Josephine, she was auditioning for another character. So hearing her say Molly's lines, who is complete opposite of Tessa, I was like, why is Tessa auditioning for Molly? It was this <laughs> weird thing. Are you a virgin? I'll do dare. Your character in particular wasn't supposed to be a woman. Can you talk about when you found out that you were going to be playing Tristan? After I auditioned for it, I checked out after and checked out the books, and then I saw Tristan was a guy in the books. And I just thought it was so cool that, you know, they made her a girl for the movie, and I play Steph's girlfriend. And mm -hmm. the LGBTQ community is so supportive of me in music and just in my life. And so I'm so happy to be able to, you know, Play. Bring that to life. Yeah, yeah, bring it to life for them, yeah. Just talk about the representation that you guys are showing on screen with that dynamic. By creating this character into a female, and then not only that, but just how Pia is and how Pia Mia, she just embodies it. She's so sweet and loving in real life. It was just easy for her to take on this character. I think it's amazing. Absolutely. And a great way to pave the way for more female roles. Tristan, like, really does have passion for Steph. You know, Kanisha and I just connect really well, and so I think that made it so easy for us to portray their relationship, but right. it's so endearing, and I think the fans are going to love it when they watch the movie. The cast admits there was pressure preparing for a few key scenes. I feel like everyone's been waiting to see how Landon and Tessa meet. That first meeting is so crucial to the right, storyline. Right. Is there pressure for you? Yeah, I mean, there's always pressure in terms of people have lived with these characters and these stories for uh, in this story this world for a really long time and so they have you know created an idea of what it should look like and what it should be so you know I definitely wanted to honor that and to honor you know their expectations I don't think we can ever be just friends <laughs> The lake scene is my favorite in the whole film, really? and it's one of my favorites in the book, too. So I was really scared with that scene going in, because on Wattpad, you can literally see the most commented on parts of the whole story. We had data behind it, so we knew that's literally like the fan favorite as well. Mm -hmm. So there was a lot of pressure to get it right. Once we were actually filming, it just came so naturally to everyone. The first day filming was such a beautiful day. The second one, we had like this thunderstorm, and you'll never see it in the film, but yeah. it was everything that I wanted it to be in their chemistry just is incredible. And in that scene, you really see like literally the moment that he looks at her and everything starts changing. And that scene is, I think it's gonna be a fan favorite still. Absolutely, that's the moment <laughs> after. And yes. when her life starts changing. <laughs> it's the first time that Tessa says yes. She says yes right. to Harden and says, okay, let me, let me see, let me explore what this is, what this, these feelings are and uh, that's why that scene is so important to me. Their favorite scene was the lake scene. Is there one that stands out in your mind that was amazing to shoot? It was a scene, it was not only the getting ready scene, but it was also the one before we were getting ready when I went into the library to tell her like, we're, we're going, going out. out, we're going out. We should go. 
But Tessa and Harden's chemistry isn't the only relationship to look out for. Joe and I are like, like legit close. We talk about acting, we talk about life, you know. Landon and Tessa are close and there's no other motive. Right. You know, he, he just, he has her back. He is, he is that rock. He loves with everything that he has and doesn't judge. And it seems promising that there will be an after part two. Yeah, I think there's a lot of talks about having at least one sequel, if not more. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah. And where do you think we'll pick up in the storyline? Well, I don't know. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, but they're obviously they have some work to do on the relationship. And this next in the next installment, I'm sure. They could start from so many different places. The way that it ended and the way that the whole movie went. I mean, it's a yeah. broad spectrum of where they can pick it back up from. So Absolutely. I hope they do. Well, okay. if people watch this movie, we get a second one. Mm -hmm. So we don't know yet. Yeah, I think it was pretty we'd good. We'd love to. We'll see. We would we'll love see. to. Yeah.